Hello viewers, welcome to our channel Career Prep. In this video, we'll learn about the concept of ages. The topic of ages is an essential part of the quantitative aptitude segment of many competitive exams. The questions from this topic may seem to be confusing and complicated, but once you have understood the concept well, you can easily answer and score marks for these types of questions. Since questions based on this topic are most frequently asked in competitive exams, it makes sense to understand the concept well. These questions are the ones where marks can be scored easily if practiced well. Before we begin, please subscribe to our channel. Also press the bell icon to get notifications as soon as we post a new video. So let's start. So here are a few important formulae related to the problems on ages, which will help you to answer the questions quickly and also to get a better idea of the concept. If you are assuming the current age to be X, then the age after N years will be X plus N years. Supposing you are assuming the current age to be 20 years, then the age after uh, 5 years will be 25 years, which is nothing but 20 plus 5 years. If you are assuming the current age to be X, then the age before N years will be X minus N years. Supposing you are assuming the current age to be 20 years, then the age before 5 years will be 15 years, which is nothing but 20 minus 5 years. If the age is given in the form of a ratio, for example, A is to B, then the age shall be considered as AX and BX. If you are assuming the current age to be X, then n times the current age will be x multiplied by n years. Supposing you are assuming the current age to be 20 years, then 2 times the current age will be 40 years, which is nothing but 20 multiplied by 2 years. If you are assuming the current age to be x, then 1 nth of the age shall be equal to x divided by n years. Supposing you are assuming the current age to be 20 years, then one fourth of that age will be equal to 5 years, which is nothing but 20 divided by 4 years. If sum of ages of x and y is a, and ratio of their ages is P is to Q respectively, then you can determine the age of X and Y by using the formula. Age of X is equal to P divided by P plus Q multiplied by A. Age of Y is equal to Q divided by P plus Q multiplied by A. For example, sum of ages of X and Y is 50 and ratio of their ages is 2 is to 3 respectively. Now we are asked to find the ages of x and y. Now the sum of the terms of the ratio is 5. 2 plus 3 is 5. Now age of x is equal to uh, 2 divided by 5 multiplied by 50 which is 20 years. And age of y is equal to 3 divided by 5 multiplied by 50 which is 30 years. Here are a few tips to solve problems on ages. After reading the question, assume the unknown age to be some variable like x. Convert the statements in the question into mathematical equations. Once the equation has been formed, solve the equation to find the answer. The obtained value must satisfy the conditions given in the problem. 
basic things like addition subtraction multiplication and division will help you to get the answer and no complicated calculations are required to answer these types of questions problems on ages can be generally classified into these types calculation of present age calculation of age before n years calculation of age after n years calculation of age based on ratio calculation of age based on average viewers please go through this video till you have understood the concept please watch all our videos on solved problems on ages for better understanding if you have liked this video please like subscribe and share this video thank you